Okay, let's try that again, shall we? <clears throat> I have no idea what fucking happened. But we'll just we'll just call it a different episode. <laughs> This. This looks like an exercising arrow for driving away evil. Hmm, but its tip is shaped like a key. In any case, I do sense its divine power for driving away evil. Wait, does that mean that I have to go all the way back up there? Thank God that they gave you away. <laughs> He's fucking scared of it. I like those keys. They're cool. I kind of wish they had access to like the the whip while I was out in like the real world, but there's probably like no use for it. looking at what do we have here yes diggy diggy dig 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 Like it over there? There's a door there. I have to imagine that I get there eventually. Hmm. C. 
save. Put a save point here, so they're going to put something. It's like some of those, oh, three of those ghost houses. All right. I'll take you on. Yeah, I don't know what happened. Like, the stream crashed for some reason. It said I was still streaming, but then, in reality, I was not. I had to like restart Streamlabs completely, so. My bad. Spirit Globe. Humanity's faith remains solid, restores three units of solar energy. Jesus. Those were nice. Also, it's okay. Understandable. Anyway, where are you ordering food from? Can you only do it once per thing? Yeah, that must be it. Waffle House. Sounds good. No lie. Yeah, you can only do uh, one trying for, for a pause. For now. I like the for now part. That gives me hope. Because I should be able to, like, sit there and circle both of them. Should. Anyway, let's deal with this next monster house. Monster House was a good movie. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I know that movie. I don't know abilities, if it makes you happy. <laughs> abilities do make me happy. Oh shit, I only got one of those things. Didn't have my thumb on the sticks. I wasn't ready. What's something you see daily that you never think about? <clears throat> My toes. <laughs> Alright, where can I bring the sun? There you are. The dishes in my sink that I never want to wash. 
Here comes the sun. Da -da -da -da. <coughs> Here comes the sun. It's okay. It's alright. Nope. It won't do anything. It just the wall looked funny. <clears throat> Ooh, I gotta kill those things. They're poisoning the water hole. Oh, I like that very much. Okami, God of War, and Osora's Wrath are my favorite games about mythology. It is a good game. It's fun. I don't think I've beaten it completely, though. Oh, of course I know it. Of course I know it. Looks like the poison that was polluting this water has completely cleared up. Now it looks like a great place for a swim. There's even a waterfall. I better be loads of fun to go straight down it. Uh, what I meant was a playful dog like Ume might do that. I haven't forgotten about what we're looking for, have you? And of course, <laughs> I haven't given up on hunting down some treasure either. I would love to ride down a waterfall if I knew that it wouldn't kill me. Sutoruan's map. Eh, it's worth a shot. Can't you ride down Niagara in a barrel? <laughs> yeah, I think so. Maybe. Dreams do come true. Circles. I think it's time to go this way. Throw that bush a circle. Anyway, I'm excited. Tomorrow will be uh, Final Fantasy Day. I'm literally just going to jump off the edge.
All right, let's save. You know what bushes love? Circles. Give that bush a fucking circle. Anything else I need to worry about? Oh. I had to be sure. seeing so much of my of Final Fantasy 7 because my friend uh, Final Fantasy of Resident Evil and The Last of Us are the only game she likes and Bayonetta but that third game isn't out but yeah <laughs> well I mean I'm excited to play it I, I'm glad that they release it early today but I don't know if I could have afforded it I would have gotten it You can use the power of Bloom to fill it in. Just fill it in with a brush and Bloom takes care of it. Ooh, I like those little fountain sprays. Trans bien. <laughs> Get excited. Ah. <laughs> I'm I'm very excited. This is this is me very excited right now. Thirty-seven. Thank you. You know what? Fuck it. I want that louder, and I want that louder right fucking now. Dude, I'm so glad that that took like zero seconds.
There we go. Yeah, I'm 37, dude. Believe it or not, that is the age of Jason. Sadly. Two plus two is four, minus one, that's three quick maths. Quick maths. Hey, look, that light. There's a constellation here, too. It's a monkey! We're in a cool hat. Wow, what style? You shook? Come on, you knew I was 37. Jesus Christ. Ah, Hamatarusu. Origin of all that is good and mother to us all. I, Sutagami, the last in the triumvirate of Hanagami Flora gods, have humbly awaited your glorious return for 100 years. I thought you were 32, but not what shook me. What shook you? Yeah, I am. I am older than 32. <laughs> Ah, <laughs> uh, may the fresh spring growth bloom from your snow white form. Would you relax? Nothing happened. What shook you? You've been so hot for so long, which is what shook me. Oh my fucking god. It's a trap! Our cruisers can't repel firepower of that magnitude. <sighs> Bring new life to the land that suffers under evil. That was Sutakami. The third and final god of Flora. He's the god that can make vines do his bidding. One folk tale tells how Sutagami used that power to tie vines to his body so that he could fly through the air. Hey, that's a Konohana blossom, the flower of the gods over there. Try making a vine sprout right out of it. Draw a line for the Konohama blossom to your body. Okay. Ah, perfect! Wow, well, sure is a handy have a god around. You can try out vines when the Konohama blossom is open. Let's look around and see if any others are blooming. I wonder. Sutagami. The shortest point between two places is a straight line. <laughs> Let's just draw a tiny line. <laughs> Three dimensions. I hate to fall from this height. Oh, 
Oh nice, it's another way up. Let's see what's up here. More of the Konohana blossoms. Right at the top? I almost didn't see that one. Oh, I was hoping that it would drag him in like a wavy line. That's not fair. These ones are upside down, so you know that means something. If you were a snack, it'd be Oreo ice cream. <laughs> Can I just be like cookies and cream? Because I'm cookies and cream on. <laughs> uh. There's something that sounds like sawing. I could also be notated as like bed noises. Anyway. It's coming from, like, right there. <sighs> okay. In here. What's wrong with Oreos, though? Is it because they're vegan? I just, I'm not a fan of Oreos, honestly. I'd rather cookie dough. Uh... One of my favorite candies is actually like the, the the cookies and cream like chocolate bars that you can get from Hershey's, even though it's like shit chocolate. It's white chocolate, so it's not even chocolate per se, but anyway. Anyway, there's, there's nothing wrong with Oreos. Not my favorite cookie. Oh, that's the wrong way. But, I mean, the fact that it's vegan is good, though. Because that means that lots of people get to enjoy it. <laughs> And not have to wor worry about hurting them animals for for the sake of a cookie. <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, I know I sneezed. It's fine. I'm not dying yet. You don't. I like that, like, Japanese guitar sound.
It's such... It, how is that sound going so fucking long? Okay. Her girl comes up to you and says, You look like the Pillsbury Doughboy. Wanna stuff something in my... <laughs> Oh, I, I bake biscuits. And then when she pokes me in my tummy, I go... <laughs> uh, restores three units. <laughs> that or I say it's like, are you making a joke from about me because I'm like fat and light and like food? This looks ominous. Why am I your favorite type of gamer? <laughs> You're really gonna go in there? Really? Are you serious? You're getting a real bad vibe here. What's beyond this door? You sure we're ready? Maybe we should go back outside. Uh, we ready. Yo. <laughs> Why wouldn't it be? No, I want to know what your favorite type of gamer is. Alright, let's go for it. Leap first, think later. That noise is so loud and persistent that I hear it over top of my playing. Your phones. Look, Hami. There's a golden gate. It'll store the memories of all you've done if you pass through it. That way, if you ever die, you can start over again from that point. It's a free pass to continue with your game, even after you mess up. But it does have its limits. Stored memories will be wiped clean if you quit the game. If you use an origin mirror to save a game, your memories will be transferred there. Either way, passing through the Golden Gate or saving with an origin mirror will allow you to continue with your adventure. Well, might as well pass on through. Yeah, so then that that means that something is happening here. Who I just told you. Well, what what makes me your favorite type? Did we just Looney Tunes it? Oh my fucking god. Uh -huh. Butthole. Oh, nice going furball. Keep telling you not to space out like that. <laughs> hey, something moved. Whoa. Whoa. Check out this big old flower. It's got like eyes inside it. Must have stumbled onto something here. Flowers like this are usually just packed with treasure. Uh-oh, it's a doggo! Hey, is that a dog down there? It's the Matrix. Hey, let me go, Wolf Breath! I'll cover it with your sober again. Oh. Check out that shadow. I see eight. Wait, it could be. Are you that dog that has been sniffing about? I will not allow you to ruin my master's triumphant return. Gross. He knows where 
does not belong will get you killed. Speak your last words, fool. It is a cool boss design, though. I like it. How dare you. Dog is not usually on my menu, but I shall make you an exception. What are you talking about? I saw that dog you gobbled up. Besides, this ain't no dog. This here is a god. Well, now, the beast can speak. Very well. Then I shall send you back to where you came from. Which shall not hurt a bit. Stand still for just a moment. I'm really glad that I, uh, increased my health. It was very, very helpful. Shit, I was actually trying to jump out of there.
increase the magic. Yeah, I'll do that next. Come on, fast boy. No, I meant me to myself. You don't have magic in this. Oh, you, I thought you meant like the ink. Now Samantarasu was able to tra traverse the vine-covered ruins and defeat the devious spider queen lurking within. The ugly Arachnid's body had been turned into a beautiful blossom. No backseat gaming, remember? <laughs> you do things how you will. And a feeling of tranquility reigned throughout the rooms. Inside the hardy blossom was discovered a tiny and defenseless dog, presumably consumed by the fearsome queen. Just when everything had begun to settle down, snarling beast, a weapon long sealed away by the spider's queen, magic appeared before Matsurasu's eyes. Oh, neat! He obtained divine instruments, snarling beast. Reflector marked with a beastly seal grants ink bullet power. The spider queen was hiding a sacred weapon? Tricky old bag. Huh. Maybe we'll get more weapons if we defeat some other monsters. Anyway, I can't wait to see what's this what this one does. Look at that, Ami. Dog's just sleeping. Wonder if this is Ume. You know, the dog the kid was looking for. Let's bring him back once he wakes up. But first, how about a good victory howl? Might even wake him up. Uh, I took too much time, and I took too much damage. Of course I want to save the game. Big ol' flower! I'm kind of I'm kind of glad it was just two uh, flowers that you had to uh, attach, not more. Bad doggy, give me back my key. I gotta go see Ume, quick. Huh? Ume, is that you? Are you okay? You're not hurt, are you? you must have been so scary all alone. Just toss the dog. What's wrong, Ume? About your dog, kid. He was deep within the ruins, and he didn't seem to want to leave. Really? How come, Ume? You mad at me for running away without you? You got it all wrong, kid. You only think you left your dog behind. Truth is, he decided to stay at the ruins himself. He did? But why? Nani? Maybe he was trying to set an example by showing you how anyone, even a dog, could have an adventure. 
Uh, look at it this way. There's not much separating a boy from a man. They grow up before you know it and accomplish great things. Uh, I see. I see. So I guess you knew everything. Ume. Like how many... Like how my dad told me to go fix the bridge destroyed by the storm. And how I tried to get out of it because I was scared of failing. But your fearless adventure has changed me. Given me the courage to stop shrink shirking responsibility. Oh, my dad's fishing pole. I lost that in the forest some time ago. Did you sniff it out in those ruins? All by yourself? Well, I'm gonna fix that bridge all by myself. Boy, is Dad gonna be surprised. Fork. Okay, cool. Now I have Snarling Beast. So it's a reflector marked with BC Seal grants eek bullet power. I need to get in the battle. How'd I miss these birds? Yeah, I like the whip still. Wait, you know how to use ink bullet? Oh, I don't. Is it just like literally just like drawing dots or some shit? Chucky, how's the fangulation going on? You should have a few of them by now. Get your boss on a treasure, my precious treasure if you do. You can explain to my in my scrolls, probably. Coins gonna even hold though. Ah, I understand now how many coins I can hold. Oh my god, there are so many of those. 
I will never get all of those. <laughs> Fishing animals. So this is how many of them that I I have fed completely. Oh my god. There is a lot of fucking shit. I have fed 5% of dog. It's fine. Oh, either either I figure it out or I don't. So, I'm not too worried about it. Sure, why not? It says you thought, just dot enemies and it's like a gun. And that's when I have it as like a main weapon, right? Like, I can only imagine it's only if I have it as a main weapon. So, whatever it said, yeah. Try it one more time. I'll try it as a gun. Hi there, Wolfie. I don't suppose you've seen my son. Seems he was hunt fishing in a deep abyss not long ago. Nowhere to be seen now, though. Oh, my son has started building a bridge at the rapids. I can't worry too much, but I should just bust out. I should just butt, butt out. The best thing I can do is to leave him to his own devices. The kid's doing exactly what you think he's doing. Okay, yeah, that that is exactly what it is.
But regardless, I like the whip better. Oh, been sent to do the shopping, have ya? Yes. So, treasures. For this fucking thing yet. Why not? Hey! I lassoed the rope to the other side. Look! Hey, you there! Get that rope out of my way! Oh my god. Susano? What's going on? A new secret technique. Imploding barrel flying monkeys was a flop. You have the power, just not the strength. Okay. I ended up being washed downstream on this tree trunk. Here he comes. Hold on to that fishing pole, kid. Oh, wait. Let go of it. No, you guys, I said let go. I mean, use your celestial brush, quick! Um. Oh, I get it. I get it. I get it. It's kind of hard to see him. Like, like, legitimately, the camera, the camera angle does not help me here. And then they blow by so fucking fast. <laughs> Waterfall! This is bad! What the fuck am I supposed to do? Just wait till you get to the mini games. Yeah, I'm sure. This is Spider Man 2 all over again. What the fuck? I don't like that if you go past... No neck snap this time though, well that's, that's, that's three, no. 
That's amazing Spider-Man 2. I'm talking about, uh, I'm talking about, uh, Spider-Man 2. Ooh, I thought we were gunners. It all worked out. Just look at that new bridge. Did I do that? Did I do that? <laughs> That's right. It was all you, kid. I don't know what was eating you, but I'll never get anywhere in, in life running from adventure. So, if the log was coming this way, we were standing at the thing, and then we're dragged that way, how are we back at the at the bridge? Uh, you should thank your doggy for teaching you that. Oh, I like the little, like, flower pattern on its side. Couldn't have done it without you, Ume. Thanks! Don't think so hard about it. Yeah, neither. <laughs> hey, where'd Pops go? I'm sure it'd take more than that to kill the guy. <laughs> He's bound to pop up somewhere. Again. Bound to. I fed the Ume. Now Ume, love me. I did it, Ume, I did it! Now I know that I should never be afraid to accept new challenges. I just love using this fishing pole. Maybe I won't end up following in my dad's footsteps. All right. Ink bullet tips. Yeah, there you go. There's a scroll that would teach me about the ink bullets. Akapas lies ahead, great plains in the mountain. Let's prepare for the worst, but hope for the best. Well, let's get going, you big furball. Takapas. Well, Takapas has been cursed too. I bet we find a withered guardian sapling around here. Oh, what's going to become of me now? That confounded cursed zone is causing all sorts of trouble. And my most precious tool of the trade has gone missing too. There's no just don't know how I'm gonna make a living anymore. Oh, stop being a bitch. Remember this dog though? Okay. No doubt this is the work of those mischievous moles. I'll bet they're the ones who stole from me, and on top of that, I have to put up with all that awful curse zone stuff. And you. I wonder what's become of Kusa Village now. It's up on Mo Mount Kam Kamiji, where the big windmill is. I heard some terrifying growls coming from the shrine there. I ran down the mountain as fast as my legs would carry me. Then I realized that this area was all cursed too. Never imagined that monsters would come anywhere near us. Looks like the end of the world is finally here. I wonder what's become of Kusa Village up on the Mount Kimiji. There's terrifying growls. Now I can't even get past the city checkpoint to go home. Dr. Pass is none of the places changed for the worse. What is this dude's mouth? Vanilla peanut butter? Like peanut butter with like a little bit of vanilla in there? Sounds fine. That should stop blowing altogether. It means I'm hardly doing any trade and talismans at all. Aren't there any travelers coming by selling things either? A fresh fish from Megata Forest would fetch a fortune right now. Well, there doesn't seem to be any good fishermen there anymore. Anyway, enough about my complaining. How about buying something, Pooch? So, the salmon? 
No, no, vanilla, but the consistency of peanut butter. Like a vanilla spread? It could be good for, like, dessert stuffs. You know what? No. We're gonna do a little bit of backtracking real quick. Uh, I picked to go back to the starting area and uh, take a look at the tree to see if there's those things that I can make bloom. And then I'm gonna end the stream. <laughs> Probably gonna end up playing more Animal Crossing, honestly. Uh, earn some more money. Not that that's what you were asking me to pick. <laughs> Animal crackers in my soup. Monkey rabbits loop to loop. That's a song, right? I went the wrong way. Is it? I think it is. How the fuck do I get out of here? What's those blooms? Fine, I'll fight you. Macaroni and meat? Oh, that sounds amazing. I want to eat that right now. How dare you? Honey, yep. That sounds amazing, too. Fucking dinner time, jerk. Yeah, ideas for food that I can't eat right now. <laughs> Jerk. Is this how I leave? Store the ideas for later? Yeah. But no, seriously, like, mac macaroni and meatballs? That's... That's an amazing idea.
It's like macaroni's already fantastic. I was just wolf. I need to increase my ink. Also, I kind of wish that the uh, size of the li lily pad would be relative to the size of your circle. Yeah, I know I can swim some of it. I just... I don't want to. I don't I don't want to take the damage. I don't want to take the damn dams. Yabba dabba doo! Ah, Okamiya Matarasuna, beloved mother to us all. I am flattered that you have judged my prayers worthy. <coughs> the vile creatures that threaten our world are growing in strength. <coughs> it is of the utmost importance that we exercise great caution. As you rejuvenate each guardian sampling, I sprout a new fruit. These are known as guardian fruit. They contain wondrous treasure that I am honored to offer you. <coughs> Each time you revive a sapling, you may return to Kamiki for more. Here, receive my offering. Remember, I have vine power now. That's true. Uh, your journey will be a long one, but perhaps this will aid you. May the fresh scents of flower protect your way. Always. Got that furball? Revive a sampling and get some fruit. I'll be shy, there's nothing like a present from a hot babe. <laughs> nothing like a present from a hot babe, huh? Am I doing this wrong? I don't remember what I'm supposed to do. How long have you been waiting to get these fruits? I don't know. Probably a while. I mean, they're just treasures. Just... <clears throat> you do not... You do things to beat your own drum. <laughs> I'm not judging you. <coughs> well, I mean, if they were, like, weapons or powers for me, then yes, I could understand, but they're just, they're just treasures that I can sell, so. 
I don't know, man. I don't know. I assume I only get, really get something good out of that, like, once I've, uh... I completed everything. Behold the great Konohana. What a glorious sight. Her lofty height seems to touch the clouds. The Konohana shall become even more beautiful. I shall perish until my... I shan't perish until my dream is fulfilled. What's my best growl? Grrr! <laughs> uh, I don't think that's gonna work the way that I want it to work. Okay. I think we're good for now. <coughs> I think that's good. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna call it for the day. I say that we made we made pretty good progress. Pretty good progress. Or at least progress enough. Rest. All I do is fucking rest. <laughs> I never leave the house. Come on. Look at me. Okay. No. I'm going to eat dinner. Dinner time. Dinner time. Okay. I will. Uh, I'll see you later. I'll be back tomorrow. Most likely. You would think. with something different. <laughs>